addressing anyone. This is my first time and my last one. I will never do it. But <sighs> what you did, I don't care how rude your follow-up video was. Was low, demeaning, disrespectful. Period. Okay. So you invited us to your home. Number one, I was sick. I didn't even want to go. Okay. So our boy was like, ah, babe, it it can buy to invite you kwa mtu home. Kwake, kwa privacy yake na hakuna kitu tunafanya alafu tukose kuenda wewe jikakamua tuende so i was like ah okay fine let's go i, I don't know i was 50 yani uh, me my instinct hata nakumkanichelewesha kila mtu my instincts to zika kuanga to very right so we go there <laughs> no matter the situation eh? if you've invited me i think that means that you you trust me enough that me I never even knew you had kids. To be honest, imagine if I went and took a photo with your kids, then posted it online because you've never posted because that's your private space, and I respect your private space, okay? And I remember your kids are smart, beautiful, and stuff. I would have taken a photo and posted them. Ah, but then I met Nani's kids, but I didn't do that because I'm in the limelight. I know when someone chooses not to have a certain thing of theirs not put out there they have their own reasons they are protecting some some sort of their peace so i need to respect that you know ha. fast forward you said what you said and you're not sorry about it Arabol, everyone knows Arabol is the least and problematic person that's why i'm with him He's not dramatic. At least I know. He's not dramatic. He's never had scandal. He's never had drama. So if you see him responding to someone, it's because they've touched a, 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 a live wire that they shouldn't touch. And yes, you have your people coming through for you, gassing you up. At this point, it's Janango 10, Latin Arab boy 1. 1 because it's Janango versus Arab. So I'm on Team Arrow, so it's 1. All right, people are gassing you up, but I don't care how many people gas you up, whatever you did was wrong, it was just outright wrong. Just that was wrong, to be honest. If it was a blogger or someone, <laughs> and if a promoter or a, a, like a fan, I wouldn't even care. But you invite to your personal space so that you can open your mouth then the least the, the next thing that follows is you trying to justify it and say you're not sorry you should ask yourself Arabo doesn't pick fights but he's offended me i'm offended but me if i ever meet you i'm gonna tell you my peace of mind one-on-one -on -one. we've been through a lot we have our own reasons as to why we keep our things to ourselves we have our angel ah, I don't wanna, in heaven. So you should have picked your. I don't wanna cry. Ah. I, 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 I don't wanna. Mm -mm. You should have picked your phone, called Arrow Boy, and asked him. Hey, I'm born out on my baby. What you have to say, bro? Not that good, you are because you never know why people do certain things. Especially if you, if it's fans. I mean, people have been talking. People have been insulting. And um, we don't care. We don't. Because that nigga lost his safari and lost his dad last year. Two people in a year. So, what she did, I don't care. If the public thinks you're right, was low, cheap. God bless your ass. 